If tile is to be set on floors adjacent to bathtub surrounds, we strongly recommend use of the Schluter Ditra or Schluter Ditra Heat Uncoupling and Waterproofing Membranes. The floors can be made fully waterproof by sealing joints in the membrane with the Schluter Curdy Band Waterproofing Strips. The result is a comprehensive waterproofing system that protects today's moisture-sensitive substrates like plywood or OSB. Please refer to the Schluter Dietra Installation Handbook for complete details before beginning your Dietra project. Schluter Dietra is installed simply and easily with modified thin set mortar, such as Schluter All Set or Fast Set in this application, since there is a plywood substrate. The mortar is mixed to a fairly fluid consistency, but still able to hold a notch. A 1 quarter inch by 3 16 inch V-notch trowel or the Schluter Dietra trowel, which features a 4.5 millimeter by 4.5 millimeter square notch design, is used to apply the mortar. Clean any dust or other debris from the substrate. Apply a thin layer of the mortar with the flat side of the trowel to produce solid contact with the surface and then comb additional mortar using the notched side of the trowel. Apply the Ditra fleece side down. Leave a 1 quarter inch wide gap between the Ditra and the bathtub apron. Solidly embed the matting in the mortar using a float. Lift up a corner of the matting to check coverage. Proper installation results in full contact between the fleece webbing and the thin set mortar. Re embed the matting. After the Dietra has been installed, Schluter Curdy waterproofing accessories are used to seal joints in the Dietra matting and connect the matting to the walls and bathtub surround. The banding is installed using any of our Schluter thin set mortars or an unmodified thin-set mortar. The mortar is mixed to a fairly fluid consistency, but still able to hold a notch. A 1 quarter inch by 3 16 inch V-notch trowel, or the Schluter Curdy trowel, which features a 1 8 inch by 1 8 inch square notch design, is used to apply the mortar. Place painter's tape to protect the face of the tub. Fill the cutback cavities in the Ditra adjacent to the bathtub and comb additional thin set mortar on top. Remove any thin set mortar from the gap between the Ditra and the tub. A 1 quarter inch backer rod or similar may be used to keep the joint clean during thin set mortar application and subsequently removed prior to Curdy Fix application. Completely fill the gap between the Ditra and tub with Schluter Curdy Fix or other suitable sealant. Apply Curdy Band to the joint. Embed the banding in the thin set mortar and curdy fix using the flat side of the trowel or a drywall finishing knife to ensure full coverage and remove air pockets. Curdy band is also used to seal floor to wall transitions. The banding may be creased prior to installation to help maintain tight corners and make subsequent tile setting as easy as possible. Apply thin set mortar to the area where the curdy band is to be installed. Embed the curdy band in the thin set mortar using the flat side of the trowel or a drywall finishing knife.
Install Schluter Curdy Carrick preformed corners using thin set mortar. Apply the mortar to the area where the Curdy Carrick is to be installed. Embed the Curdy Carrick into the thin set mortar using the flat side of the trowel or a drywall finishing knife. Corner installation may be simplified by holding one side of the corner in place while embedding the other side of the corner in the mortar. Repeat this process at all remaining joints, ensuring that the minimum two inch overlap is achieved at all transitions. Sealing seams in the DITRA and connections to the bathtub surround assembly improves the overall utility of the bathroom by providing comprehensive waterproofing in an area that is repeatedly exposed to moisture. For all of the details on the different features and benefits of using DITRA and how it can enhance your tile installation, check out our complete video, How to Install Schluter DITRA Uncoupling and Waterproofing Membrane. If you still have questions, please contact our customer support specialists. For more information on Schluter products, visit schluter.com or check out our YouTube channel to view our videos.